Well, I want to thank the chairman first for uh, this hearing and uh, his leadership here at the Military Construction and Veterans Affairs Subcommittee, and most of all, thank General Petraeus for uh, his presence here today. I want to thank you on behalf of all the people of Tennessee, where you have a, uh, a storied history as well, everything from commanding the Screaming Eagles of the 101st Airborne to having surgery at the hands of Senator Bill Frist, and uh, a little bit of everything, I think, in between. Um, I've had the privilege in the last 15 years to meet kings and become personal friends with prime ministers and presidents and hold Mother Teresa's hands and pray with her in the Capitol, and I consider your presence here today one of those high moments in my service. And we're honored. Uh, you're one of America's greatest living citizens, and we're so grateful for your service, the premier soldier of our generation. And we thank you for what you've done, what you continue to do, and your willingness to head up CENTCOM at a critical moment uh, where success is imperative and our presence in the world is very necessary. And um, I thank you and, and look forward to your testimony and the questions and answers. And on behalf of uh, everyone on our side and our subcommittee and the Congress, we stand with you in a bipartisan and unified way until you are successful on every front. Thank you, General.